Hey everyone, thanks for watching. I'm illustrator John McCoy. I'm based in Cincinnati, Ohio. And as you may know, I'm doing a daily drawing challenge in 2020 where I do a drawing every day. Um, each one is, recently they've been about an hour long. This one's also an hour, 60 minutes to do this drawing. And I use an 18 by 24 pad of newsprint paper and vine charcoal. I've been kind of on a vine charcoal kick. I've realized that my daily drawings have gone, they've flown through different things that I'm interested in learning and different medias. And uh, it's kind of cool to, to realize, like it's kind of taking its own course of, I learned something or I want to learn something, I'm on a kick. And it's kind of the organic process of learning in general. Um, but the vine charcoal is really nice for the additive and subtractive qualities, which I find to be number one, to be painterly because painterly you have this sort of infinite canvas of infinite layers of change which is almost achievable with the vine charcoal you can um, take the kneaded eraser and eliminate passages of charcoal in areas desired areas on your drawing surface which is really cool for exploring value understanding value and form as well as shape and general proportions so for this drawing exercise, it, um, I took a photo, I set up a nice lighting situation, and then took a photo of my own hand, my mom's hand, and my dad's hand. And um, basically the idea was to study and to learn all the fundamentals and all the qualities of drawing as I'm going. That's my general goal. But I, I, like I said, I'm, I'm in, entering into kind of personal trends and things I want to learn at, at a certain time. And um, I'd say one of the main things I learned with this one is something that I'm aiming for in all of them, but it's intentionality of each stroke, each effort, um, on each mark you make on the page. I'm trying to be more intentional with that because I've noticed that when you go on autopilot, you rely on concepts which are um, p potentially faulty. Uh, it's good to, if you're striving like I am for realism and accurateness as far as not only what you're seeing value-wise but uh, edge relationship, everything, like expressing the quality and the character, adding that extra dimension to it, it all requires intentionality. Each You can't go on autopilot um, because it, it diminishes not only the realism, but the character and life of the drawing itself. So, and I've also found that it's much more enjoyable to put that intentionality in there. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please, please subscribe and God bless.